How, how, how much two days do you have in your life? life? Hi guys, how's it going? Um, I'm Noah from Hubbo. Hi everyone, I'm Asaf from Hubbo. Um, so we're going to be running a little TED talk about Jewish spaces in our life. We're going to start with a weekly Luz. A oh. weekly Luz? Amazing. So what we're going to do is everyone's going to grab some paper, pens from your house. You can pause the video if you want to, but it's important that we grab just paper and pens. Okay, so now you've got your pen and paper, what we're going to do is we're going to grab a piece of paper and we're going to create a weekly time schedule for the week. So we're going to go from Monday to Sunday and we're going to fill in what we're doing each day as detailed as much as you can. So pause the video, take your time, create your weekly schedule, something that looks like this. I can see I've got work and I've got hubbo meetings. There you go. <laughs> so pause the video and create your weekly schedule. Sweet. So now if you've finished your weekly Liz, what we're going to do is we're going to take our Liz and we're going to cross out any activity throughout the day that doesn't involve someone Jewish. Um, so that's excluding your siblings. For instance, in my one, I've crossed out work because uh, no one in my work is Jewish. Um, also got stuff that I do by myself like music and chill. So just cross out anything, any space throughout your weekly schedule where you don't interact with other Jews. So pause the video and take your time to do that. To do that. Awesome, so now that we've done crossing out the spaces where there are no Jews, um, what we're going to do now is we're going to circle Jewish spaces. So a Jewish space can just be a place where you hang out with other Jews, maybe it's synagogue, maybe it's uh, online calls you have with your youth group. Um, so what I've done is I've circled my spaces, I have a, a lot of hubbo pula and meetings, and so those are my Jewish spaces throughout my week. So take your time, pause the video, and circle any Jewish space that occurs throughout your week. Amazing. So now have a look at your weekly Luz and reflect. Do you have many Jewish spaces? Do you have many spaces without Jewish people? Is it a lot? Is it a little? Just think about it. Have a look. What we're going to do now is everyone needs to go grab, if you already have, you're amazing, a piece of paper or two. Two pieces of paper. Cool. Once you have that, you're going to write right in the middle of the piece of paper. Why is having a Jewish space important? That's it. Give you a couple, couple seconds to write that. <laughs> okay, once you've done that, you're going to write the answers to the question all around the piece of paper. I want you to really think about the reasons, like personal reasons, how does it affect you? How does it affect your family? All of those things. Cool. I'll give you like a minute to whatever. Pause the video, come back whenever you want. Right, now that you've done that, um, you're going to get your other piece of paper or maybe just flip that same piece of paper around. And you're going to write right in the middle of the piece of paper again. Are there enough Jewish spaces in your life? Enough Jewish spaces in your life. Cool. Um, if yes, then that's it. If no, what you're going to do is you're going to write around the piece of paper um, what Jewish spaces you'd like or what Jewish environments you want in your life in general. Take, take a couple minutes, pause the video. All right, so normal, normally in a Pell Lao we'd talk about this, but um, as it's a video, it's pretty hard to. So what I want you to do is I want you to really reflect on this. If you need, try and, try and write down some Jewish spaces that you want. Plan it. Make it, a, make it a part of your life. Um, Do you want it to be a part of your life? That's the question as well. Um, so the aim of this video is for you guys to reflect on, on the amount of Judaism in your life. Are you happy with it? Do you want more? Do you want less? Whatever the answer is, make it happen. There are Jewish spaces to be a part of. You just have to use them. Um, yeah. Guys, have a good week. Hopefully um, lockdown ends soon um, and we'll be back to running regular Pell Lot. Um, otherwise, check us out online. On the line. On the line. Alright. <laughs> <laughs>